Eyewitness News Analyst Lieutenant General Reginald Centrocchio joins us in studio right now. Tony just mentioned the devastation that took place in Puerto Rico with Hurricane Maria. Now we have aircraft and equipment down in Puerto Rico. What happens to all of that? You know, Mike, not many people understand that there's a lot of preparation in addition to the preparation. All those aircraft have to be evacuated, especially when you gusts of wind is up 90, 100 miles an hour. You don't have aircraft on the field because it'll tip them over, even though they're tied down. So they're evacuated to somewhere else where the wind is, and rain isn't going to be a, 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 a cause to be concerned about. And the same thing happens, obviously, here in Rhode Island, uh, as did happen. All right, so Superstorm Sandy, for example, that's what you're alluding to. Uh, it was not a hurricane when it got here. It was a tropical storm, but all that equipment was, aircraft was taken out of Quonset, right? Exactly. And when that happens, obviously, it, it, it goes inland somewhere, perhaps into Pennsylvania or some other inland base, uh, just waiting to come back in the event that they need it or to be further deployed. So much of the aircraft and, and, and the material that we see uh, after the fact comes back in. You don't leave aircraft on the field during a 90 mile an hour gust of wind. We've seen deployments to uh, Texas and Florida. Are we going to see more here? Most certainly you will. Uh, obviously Puerto Rico is a U.S. territory and uh, most likely you'll see some uh, consideration for deployments by the uh, 148A wing once again. And one quick thing, General Operation Stand Down. It was a huge success this weekend. So many, so, so many veterans getting help. Absolutely. We had well over 2,000 veterans were there, uh, ranging everything from clothing to physical uh, food, uh, obviously uh, uh, traffic adjudication, and referrals to the VA, regional VA, as well as province VA. Tremendous success, 25-year uh, celebration that went with that. Oh, we want to thank all the volunteers that helped out that weekend. Thank too. you.